everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve the unknown software exception error code 0xE06D7363 that you are experiencing on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So all you have to do is open up your browser of a choice. It doesn't really matter which one. And you want to go to Google. So let me just close out of that. And into Google search, you want to go ahead and look for Visual C++ Redistributable. And one of the best results should be from Microsoft Domains. Again, get directly from Microsoft here, Microsoft.com. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to go underneath the latest redistributable version. Select the Time64 version. Again, that's for most of you guys, unless you're running a 32-bit version of Windows 10. Windows 11 is all 64-bit. But anyway, at this point, you can close out of the web browser. You want to agree to the license terms and conditions and select Install. Select Yes if you receive a user account control prompt. And then you must restart the computer before you can use the software. Make sure you save and close out of any open programs and applications, and, and then proceed to select Restart. And now that you're back in Windows, open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match, it's say command prompt, right click on it, and then run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now you want to type in SFC space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. And now that that has concluded, go ahead and close out of here. And you want to restart your computer. And there you go, guys. So hopefully this point of issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.